How many people here know Shad? Have met him. For those that have met Shad, that's Shadow, C H A D O W, 427 on the forum. He's a madman, he's a maniac on the track. He will roast tires, street tires with cords showing in the burnout box and make more smoke than O'Neill and I combined in the box on, awesome. on slicks. We invented this award because of him, because there were things that happened with his car, and it was proven on the forum when people, even at Intense, were crying bullshit. I had to call Intense and tell them, I've been under that hood, and I've seen that car run, and it ain't bullshit. You should factory sponsor it. We invented this board on behalf of Chad, because he truly had a factory freak, and it really was. We were afraid to touch anything on that car at the risk of disturbing whatever magic was in it. And this year, it goes to somebody, bone stock, in the same generation Bonneville, not a single mod on it, that damn near broke into the 14s by what, 0.01? Like a hundred a second? That's insane. And even the Dark Knight, Darth Thomas, who raced for the dark side today, was impressed with what your car did today. Very impressed. Kevin. We've got a lot of 2Ks that normally come out every year, and that, that, was, that was pretty cool. Pretty cool. Well done. I thought I was going to get there, though. Yeah. Hey, you were going so to Jared. Jared. <laughs> so did Jared, and look at that one. <laughs> <laughs> Next one uh, goes for best uh, co-pilot, and this one's kind of a personal one for me because I knew that I couldn't make it down here Thursday. Uh, early Thursday morning to make it out to the coast room, which has always been probably one of my favorite events, uh, even above track day. Uh, I really wanted to make it down here, and without his help, I probably wouldn't have. So I'd like to award this to Taylor for best co-pilot. Even struggling through driving a Ford Aerostar <laughs> through the that middle of the way. desert in eastern Washington. So. Bravo. WCBF noob. That's spelled lowercase n, big O, big O, lowercase b. I thought that was spelled with zeros. Even though he's been here to a mini meet before, the WCBF noob award goes my buddy Ray. Good job, Ray. Someone's going to have to leave luggage here for you guys to get all these awards back. I know. I should have brought a wagon with us. We're um, breaking up the uh, schedule here. And I get to go twice in a row. Because John almost gave this to Jared. And he's not even here. Um, the MVP award is a new one that we started last year. That must have been two years ago. Because Taylor got it last year. I got it the year before. Taylor got it last year, too? There you go. <laughs> Those have been around my house the last week, the last yeah. few days. I have no doubt that uh, the MVP award has no business being in any other hands than Mr. Exuberant. Yeah. Bravo! Next year, you better bring the coffee out to the campground because I missed it this morning. Offered coffee this morning. Wendy got the last of it. Still some left in there. Can you come to my place? No. Next one goes to uh, most unique member, and uh, this is another one that we can probably hand out to everyone here. <laughs> we're all kind of special in our own way, but um, what can I say? Uh, this guy has been uh, coming down here now for four years, I think, now, and uh, he's been pretty invaluable to me and, and a lot of people here, not only, uh, you know, for a helping hand, but, you know, for a nice smile or someone to pick on, and uh, this one goes to Matt. So, most of
find the pits is a hell of a lot more than what goes on in support of the racers and the cars on test and tune and on race day. But it, it also carries back to what happens here at the campsite, even around my house while things are going on, who's helping who do what, with a lot of emphasis on keeping things organized and keeping things eyes on people and keeping people fed and filled with alcohol <laughs> and uh, when they need it and stuff like that. And we always get four of them out every year because there's always at least that many. But there's also another one that follows later for the one that really stands out, and that's one of the three coveted golden coils. So the first four pit crew awards, and I have Miss Charming Margaret, Miss oh, Charming Katie, Katie, Mr. Charming Thomas, Darth Thomas, and I'll explain this in a minute. Don't look like you're freaked out or anything. And Caddy Matt up here. Ow! Oh, yeah. Caddy, Caddy Matt. Caddy Matt. Hauling stuff to the track. Being here every year in nothing other than a support role and getting a thrill out of running your truck one of the days and doing everything else we need. Always there in the pits. Hauling heavy ice buckets from the tail end of our line out of the sleeper's trunk today to the front of the line about the Zilla. Thank you very much. Right. And for stepping up and make sure the 89 hit the track today. I was going to say that next. Right. Or John was. Oh, oh, you. You. When we're back in the pits, we're going to be able to go to the with my car? You're always there. Thank you. Thank you. Water runs, run back and forth to get Bugsy from his campsite. <laughs> <laughs> Never giving me a Ray. call word or anything in response. <laughs> medic. Medic. Yeah, medic. Don't forget medic. And Margaret for being the campfire mom, campsite mom, keeping people organized, filled with liquor, feeding them lasagna. Thank you. And, and having pictures taken with me. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was nice. <laughs> Thank you. goes to track hound um, been hitting the track up at PDX quite a bit uh, Bill Behind Thomas, there. Thomas is leaning on it. Always looking at them. No, there's a cooler. I brought a cooler. I think, I think Thomas is leaning on it. Oh. Oh, okay. There it is. Come here, beautiful. I'm almost there. Oh. Why are you talking to me? This one goes to best in class reaction time. This young man got a point oh oh nine. Not even trying. Of course, with the slicks. Cheater. <laughs> it was the pressure. Katie, <laughs> <laughs> hey, I got another one for you to stuff. 